What is going on everybody? Carrying the team here and today bring you guys some Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies gameplay on the map Dur Eisendraka. As uh we're gonna start off here real quick. This is um this is the new zombie map that dropped that just dropped today on um as part as part of the Awakening DLC. I did go through I did play through this map once just to get acclimated with it and just to see what it was like and all. And um yeah, it's actually pretty interesting. I really enjoy it, and um, I'm really excited to be sharing some gameplay with you guys. I'll, just, I'll be quiet for the rest of this scenario, or this introduction. This wasn't how it was supposed to go. We were supposed to secure the package and be in and out clean. What package were they talking about? Instead, the whole thing's been one disaster after another. Eat my blade, beast! God fucking boom, maggot addicts! Today, you die! Four, three, First, I took your legs. Now, I take your life! I should never have trusted you, Richtofen. Never. Well, that was quite an interesting introduction. Um, I, I'm I'm curious as to what package they're referring to, but uh, that might that might be the Easter egg on this map, which uh, unfortunately I don't know how to do. But um. In this gameplay, I'm just gonna try to um, show off the map, try to get Juggernog and um, well, of course, get Juggernog and um, build the Wrath of the Ancients and the Gravity Spikes and um, I get somewhat, hopefully, get far somewhat. Um, this is a pretty, this is like a, it's like a secret Nazi facility, supposedly, and the box is over on the right side. So we're gonna be. Taking the right side of the map. We're gonna be going through that door, hopefully next round. All right, now we're just gonna rack up our points. The traditional zombies round one style. That uh, should be last one. And it is. All right, 50. Actually, you know what? While we're here, almost forgot to show. Almost forgot to get. Quick revive is once you go up, you go at the top of the steps, and quick revive is right here, in this little um, in this little room right next to the door that goes to the left side of the map, at least from spawn left side of the map. There you go. Already breaking in. Already out of ammo. Already, already out of ammo. Essentially, which is unfortunate. So I guess we'll just resort to knifing. So two, we got one, two, three, four left. All right. You know what? We'll open the doors now. Um, and then we'll open up this door. Now the reason why I opened up this door too, not just to say and not save money, is because one, the box is here, and two, the way the way you get the you build the um, wrath of the ancients, the little the awesome bow, the bow bow and arrow, it's like explosive bolt. You have to. There's three dragons all around the map. One's right here. The other one's in like the underground area, which is down there, and the other and then the other one's by the um by the main part. And see the dragon spawns as soon as you kill a zombie. It upon the energy of the dead. I don't know why it's not taking this zombie. It's right here. All right. Wait for the zombie to come into view of the dragon. And um, it's just like Mob of the Dead. If, if anyone remembers that map, you have to. There's a certain amount of um, like zombies you have to feed in order for it to go away. And or successfully open, um, or successfully complete the dragon part of that map. And, um, 
yeah, so for round two, we do. I'd like to get some more points, and uh, we have 420. Illuminati confirmed. Not anymore. It appears that Maxis is unable to contact me at this time. 560 points. I only need. Well. I'm gonna try to hit the box as soon as I get 950 points. Yeah, uh, already in. Wonderful. I'm gonna die. That was close. Actually, you know what? Put the box now, because I need a gun pretty badly. This, this gun will gladly do. I love this gun, the dragon's a beast. Oh, that's missed. And we're just gonna, we're gonna take the first early rounds of Ghost Lord because I'll be training and just picking these guys off one by one so that the dragon, we could just complete this dragon. On round three, looking pretty good. I mean, it is round three, you never know. Things can go south very quickly. Alright, wonderful. I'm not gonna get the nuke yet. I will get this though. Oh, I was looking for that. One of the wanna get this dragon this dragon done before it is too late and Alright, dragon's done. And we were still able to salvage the nuke. Which is good. Hey, we'll get that extra 400 points. This is the Gorgon. Now, I'll take this for now. I'm not a huge fan of this gun only because it fires really slowly. It's the only bad part of it. Any reports from the giant suggesting my demise are erroneous. See now, the only I'm probably gonna trade this gun in very quickly, but um. The only problem with this gun is that, like I said, it's very slow to fire. And uh, if you got a horde of them, especially on higher rounds, they won't go down so easily. When when I do get over towards the left side of the map, we're probably going to be staying there because that is the best area for us to like train and just survive. Try to go for the headshots. One shot headshots are pretty nice. Pretty good accuracy, I'll take it. Actually, you know what? While we're at it, we're gonna go ahead and open up the store up here. And it is indeed dogs round on round five. Open up this real quick. Do you know what? Well, actually, we'll go down here. Ah, oh, hello. Where are they? Got one. Got another. I just just sit in this corner and chill. Alright, max ammo. Let's reload our guns. And this gun's good. And we are good. Dr. Grove, have you made any progress? Yeah, Doctor. The machine is ready. Innovating. Well, we'll enable this landing pad. <laughs> Very good. Need I will proceed with Operation Shield and join you shortly. Security protocol 935. No, no. No, uh, no actually. Maxis and his daughter have already been dealt with. I was used to Gorgon now while I can actually enjoy it, the use of it. Before and later rounds, it gets pretty, pretty, uh, not beneficial. Oh, I say. Death Machine. Death Machine's pretty beast on this map. Oh, pretty beast. I love it. It goes absolutely in, and the good part about the this Death Machine compared to, like, the Black Ops 1 Death Machine you would get on an Ascension is that it actually gives you the points that you, um, kill. And it's actually, and especially on um, double, if you have like double points, 
It's very nice. Very nice. I think... Um, oh, unfortunately we couldn't get them. Uh, I'm not going to get that instant kill yet because I want to save these zombies. Because we are going to go ahead and um, turn on the power. We, we should have enough points to get by these two doors, I think. I spent many happy nights here. So many... Working. No time to dwell. All right, got one more. 1,500. And the power is right here. Wonderful. Here to the left, right from power, we have stamina. It's a pretty useful perk, but um, I'm not. It's, it's not my chief concern yet. Actually, you know, we'll go. We'll go ahead and get this dragon done. The second dragon in this like main room is right here on the top of the fireplace. And speed cola can be found right here as well. And this this area right here is usually where I'm going to be training for this match. Because it's, it's actually circular and um, it's pretty. It's well suited for training for um, for training some zombies. Round seven. Got away from the comments so that the dragon can eat him. This area we can train. We can train pretty nicely in this area too. It's ah, I should not have gotten that. Crap. Around like to around 12, I believe. Uh, we're gonna get a uh, Panzer, a little mini Panzer. If, if you guys remember from Origins in Black Ops 2, those little Panzer guys that spawn in, like spawn in every like four rounds or so. Well, here they spawn every like six, starting on round 12, I believe. Um, and so they're they're a real pain to deal with, but we got to be prepared for that. Whoa! See, now this is what happens when you don't pay attention. They caught me from behind as I was killing this guy for the dragon, but it's fine. I mean, it happens. It's just a dumb mistake. I only had quick revive. I'm not really gonna freak out over that loss. No big deal. Alright, that's round eight. Hopefully, get this guy fed. By, um, by the end of this round, and hopefully we'll actually have enough to go get some Juggernaug.